Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today we're going to talk about clocks and um, it comes from one question that I had from a um, user that uh, was watching my videos. Um, one of the missing things in Windows 8 that I really enjoyed in Windows 7 and Vista is uh, those famous gadgets that you had a clock and a calendar and the weather and stuff like that visible on the desktop. Um, unfortunately in the desktop of Windows 8 they took out gadgets. It's not available anymore which is unfortunate. So um, one thing that you can do though to replace it is to have a clock, a live tile with the clock and date on your Windows 8 start menu. And so I've had it clocks, which is that nice little clock right here, gives you today's date and today's time. And it's a live tile, so it's always visible, and you can change the color, customize it like you want, which is cool, and I really enjoy it. So um, this clock is in the Microsoft Store. It's free. Um, all you have to do is go into the search when you're on the Microsoft Store on the upper right and type clock, press enter. The one I chose, as you uh, see here, there's many clocks, but the one I chose that I enjoy is uh, the one that says clock plus plus. So this is the tile that I clicked on, the gray one. So it's called clock plus plus and it's customizable in different types of views and uh, so this is a cool little uh, app and actually is nice because it also gives you a full screen clock with very very beautiful backgrounds if you want so clock plus plus go and get it free of charge once installed you'll have to go and get it in the um, if you have Windows 8 it's gonna be on the screen but if you have Windows 8.1 it's going to be with all your apps, so you'll have to go and click that little arrow on the bottom left and uh, get your clock plus plus. Right click on it and pin to start so that you can have it at the start screen like I did. And then just move it along where you need to uh, view it. Once it's there, it's really cool because it's customizable. So this is what it looks like actually at this moment, Friday, November 1st as we see here and the time is 12 16 it's noon um, this is one of the choices of backgrounds that you can actually put in the um, app so you can go on the top of your screen and get this little bar if you have a touch uh, device I believe you can swipe down from the top and there you'll have seconds you can put it at 12 hour clock you have the date you can put the week which is pretty nice also and on the uh, font size you can actually uh, enter a font size here it says 520 I'm not sure um, let's, maybe it's the number of pixels yep yeah, it seems to be number of pixels so you can put like a, let's put 650 here we go we have a bigger clock uh, the team which is ocean that you can uh, of course change to any types of uh, screen that you like, lobster, gray. Uh, the uh, default setting is steel, which is a very modern look, metallic look. Ocean 2, which is this one. And so you can actually um, customize this uh, video, this uh, video, sorry, this uh, clock as you want here on the screen. So it's a pretty nice, big, full screen. But what's cool is that when you're on your start menu, it's there on the tiles and it always shows you the time. So it's a convenient way of instead of always going to the charms bar, get the time and date from your uh, Windows machine. You actually have it right here on the, uh, on the start menu and uh, you can customize. Uh, the look of your uh, tile so you can uh, for example uh, resize the tile uh, here it's in the wide you can put it uh, medium or small depending on what you want to accomplish 
Um, the only thing that I haven't found that I don't see any um, any ways of actually changing this is the color of this tile that is gray and I don't see any options to actually change the, the tile color which is kind of um, a little annoying but um, apart from that uh, it does seem to um, pre be a pretty nice option here uh, personalize I see I don't uh, I see that this says it's gray but that's doesn't that's the background color the accent color uh, nothing much it doesn't change anything on the uh, on the tile itself I believe um, still stays like that so uh, I believe well from what it seems that you, you can't really customize the tile itself I would have enjoyed having a instead of a gray tile um, maybe putting it in a different color uh, on your start menu so um, this is kind of the uh, little probably the, the, the little annoying part of this uh, tile is the fact that you can't just customize it on the start menu so you'll have a great tile from what I see if anyone finds a way to change this color tell me and I'll be uh, put the comments in the section below the video but uh, basically it's a cool little clock it's free of charge and adds a clock on your start menu I know it's not a clock on your desktop if you use a lot of desktop but at least you'll have an easy way to switch from your desktop to your start menu check the time with the Windows key and come back um, in the uh, desktop um, you have of course also the fact that you always have visible the time and date on the bottom right of your screen so uh, that's another reason why you might not need that type of information on the uh, desktop but it's cool now you have a tile with date and time and uh, as you've seen when you went to the uh, Microsoft Store there's a lot of uh, different clock apps so uh, check out the different ones also a lot of free uh, clocks which is pretty cool also so if you um, want to have a live tile uh, this one seems to be really nice also on the uh, screen and um, click for uh, check for clock plus plus and it adds a live tile with time and date on your Windows 8 machine if you enjoy our videos please uh, subscribe to our channel click uh, the like button that's the way we uh, get more views and more popular all the time and uh, if you have any comments questions maybe you have your favorite clock app that you enjoy and you want to share it with us let us know what you uh, what you use maybe as a clock and um, hopefully you enjoy our videos and we'll come back to the official Windows 8 channel and if you have a feature of Windows 8, 8 Windows 8.1 and also um, maybe an app that you'd like us to review let us know we'll try to put that video online thanks for watching and hope to see you again